I'm filming now. <laughs> oh, you are? I pressed record, you know. Oh. I don't know if I did by accident, but I, sometimes I, I, I twitch too a little bit. Uh, whoops. <laughs> oh. Ah, this is nice though. Holy moly. No, we're not in Oregon yet. <laughs> no, we're not. <laughs> but we can pretend though, you know, because, hey, you know, if we saw some mountains, then we, it, would, it would feel like we're actually there. You know? But we're not here. We're not there yet. Another week or another few days, actually. Well, by the time people see this, we'll probably be already on the on the way or whatever. I'll probably upload this on Monday, probably. And we're making for maybe a bonus feature on that DVD or documentary, maybe two. But we'll see if anybody actually wants to buy it at all. Ah, this is nice. Yeah, I, I bought a new house. <laughs> yeah, we're roommates now. <laughs> yeah. No, I'm just, ha I'm just visiting with my good friend Mike here, you know, we're, we're going to be going on vacation here pretty soon. A lot of people still don't think that's actually going to happen, they think I'm just fucking with them or whatever, but... <laughs> no, I'm not fucking with anybody, we're actually we're actually doing this. Are we not, Mike? Are we doing this? Oh yeah, we are <laughs> doing this. Sure. So, we're going to have a, we're, we're just hanging out today, we're going to go eat at a place called Earl's Drive-In, have a, a little pre-vacation celebration, kind of, you know. But, uh, what's going on there, Mike? And now, <laughs> what you been up to? Yeah. I was pretty much working, and then I guess was it the last week or something? It's been kind of busy, but other than that, it's been pretty good so far. Yeah. Yeah. So what do you what do you expect out of this vacation? Like what? Like tell tell the people why you actually want to go with me. What's the purpose? Why, why am I not going by myself? <laughs> Well, I kind of want to do some like a touring of the Goonie House, and then the other one is the Kiengard Cup. Okay. But I mean, like, what what are you like? Like, what is the purpose to why you're you're coming? I mean, you've told me already, but tell the the people who are going to be watching our documentary why you wanted to go with me. Why am I not going by myself? Why are you coming with? You have to think about this, you know. <laughs> it's okay, yeah. I'm not sure. Well, well the reason why is basically like <laughs> brain farts, eh? <laughs> yes, I guess so. I know. I, I don't mean to put you on the spot. I just. Whip out this camera here. I put you on the spot. Yeah, I'm gonna, thanks. yeah, I'm an asshole. Oh, <laughs> it's okay though. Hey, you know, <laughs> I've been put on the spot so many times. I tell you, it's unbelievable. Yeah. You just gotta be spontaneous, you know, like Shay Carl. <laughs> People put him on the spot all the time, and he's just like, re he's just ready for it, you know. <laughs> but uh, well, I'll, I'll explain a little bit, kind of why you're coming with me. Well, you're the first friend that I've had that I haven't known that long, but I've known pretty much almost nine months, that actually has ever actually wanted to go with me on a journey like this, you know. Most of the friends that I've had in the past would probably more or less laugh at me, you know, to say, why would you want to waste your time going, especially when you've already been there already, why do you want to go back? What's the whole purpose? But, you know, I, I've always, I've just been thinking just the fact that you want to go with, because, you know, I told you about the fact that I was alone last time, and that nobody wanted to go with me. I asked around, nobody wanted, not even my family members wanted to go with me. They said, oh, we can't afford it. Oh, you can afford it. <laughs> but they, they thought it was a waste of trip or whatever. But but you want to go with me because, you know, to have fun, to, to get out of here. You know, to, you kind of feel the same feels that I have as far as, you know, it's, it's, it's time for us to escape a little bit. We're not leaving for good. We're coming back, you know, but... We, des we deserve this, you know. We worked pretty hard, I think, you know. I waited four years for this. You waited probably, I don't know how long you waited, you know. Probably prior to even knowing me at the time. Probably won't. I mean, who knew that you, uh, you know, were ever interested in going to Astoria, Oregon. But but it's cool, though, and we're going to have a good time doing this. And I just wanted to confirm everything you know, via this because some people were asking me, a couple of people on YouTube were asking me, it's just for real, you know, are, we, are you just making this up, are you just fucking with us, you know, <laughs> no, uh, we are, we will be on the train, <laughs> yeah, no in a few days, we got reservations made, we got hotel reservations, 
uh, the, the thing is, I just want to film the documentary because uh, last time I didn't, didn't do that. Last time I didn't have a camera. The camera I gave you would not be enough to film. I mean, you couldn't fit that much information. It only can hold maybe 30 minutes of a video and that's it. Can't take pictures or nothing. This one can. And the only reason why we're not recording HD is because for some reason, I'm pretty sure it's just a memory card. It takes up too much space, and then all and then it doesn't always record all everything. In standard, like where we're at right now, it records everything, so it's, it's fine. You know? So I can record you know, lots of stuff if I want to. But anyway, so so other than the trip itself, like like what are you like like what are you looking for? Like what are you what experiences besides the Goonie House and the Kindergarten Cop? Because that's what everybody that's what everybody goes for when they go there. I mean, I gave you, we did an itinerary to kind of give you an idea of kind of what we could do. Like, what are you looking forward to seeing out of that? <laughs> I took it, I put you on the spot. Like, what kind of things? Well, I mean, like, you know, like in the, like in the itinerary, we went to that website, oldoregon.com, yeah. their official site. Like, they got a uh, trolley. Yep. It's like, takes you on like a one hour tour. It's pretty much on the, it's pretty much on the coast, pretty much, you know, because we're going to the west coast and everything. But it's like real close to where the ocean begins, except it's like on a little railroad thing. Yeah. But you know that, and then the Maritime Museum, which is like because they're known for their aquaticness and whatever. Uh, and other than just the Goonie House, because that will be the obviously the big highlight. Obviously, if we can actually get inside, that would definitely be, you know, a huge highlight. For all of us. But. Then things just like. You know I want to try that place called Gino's Pizza. That I was telling you about. Yeah. It's a real restaurant. It's right next to that one place that used to be. In the, in the, in the, the deleted scenes of the Goonies film. They go to the supermarket. Where they. You know before they go on their. Go to the cave or go to where the restaurant is or whatever. Or start searching anyway. And. It, it's actually a coffee place now. And it's been that way since like 1995, but right next to it there's a place called Gino's Pizza. It's like a red building, pretty much, and it's been there for a long time. And it's the place that we I want to go and try out a pizza. <laughs> and you know, it's just gonna be just us just having a good time, and and uh, we're, you know, I'll be filming a lot. Mike will be filming a lot. You know. Where we put putting up posts, po uh, not posters, yeah, posters, <laughs> pictures. Because uh, I'm bringing my sister. I'm actually buying my sister's laptop, you know, which will I'm bringing it with, which Mike did get a chance to see it and everything, so he knows what it looks like. Uh, so that if you guys want to keep, uh, you know, with us on Facebook and stuff while we're going on the vacation, uh, you know, whether it be my Facebook page or his Facebook page, uh, we're going to be putting up live pictures throughout the whole trip. Rather than buying a disposable camera that hardly will work or whatever and yeah. taking crappy pictures, you know, we're going to take live pictures throughout the whole trip. So be watching my Facebook page at least and, and Mike's page, his page too, because we'll be tagging each other. <laughs> <laughs> and so it should be a lot of fun. I just wanted to confirm everything. Obviously, you know, the last video I made was just me talking about, you know, what we're going to be doing. But since they haven't seen you much since the last video, which was back in March, <laughs> we went to Grand Forks. Yeah. So, anyway, I figured I'd just make this short little video. This will be the last video that you see of, of, of Mike and myself until we go on vacation. The next video you see will be day one of our, our adventures. Now, they do have Wi-Fi there, but I don't know how good the Wi-Fi will be on the train. I mean, it's hard to say. But I know at the train station, at, at, uh, at uh, Portland... <laughs> <laughs> Brain fart there. They have a uh, Wi-Fi all around, so if we can't upload the video footage from our first day adventure anyway on the train, pretty much, uh, and and part of the well, the documentary won't be uploaded till after it's all that's the trip's all done, but it gets all edited. But the YouTube videos that are separate from it might not be uploaded until we get to Portland because we're gonna be waiting a lot, waiting for a bus and everything, but. We'll see what happens. You know, we're not. We don't really have a plan. It's just everything that happens will just happen for, for a reason, I guess. <laughs> I guess so. so anyway, I'm Frankie Slauson.
you know, me, hey, <laughs> Mike, my good friend Mike. Yep. Hey. And uh, I hope you guys enjoy our, our big vacation. This is this is it, it, it means a lot to me, but it'll mean just as much to Mike. And I hope it will mean a lot to you guys too, because this kind of comes full circle with me, uh, at least when, when it comes to going to back to Astoria, Oregon again. So anyway, I'll see you guys later, and see you later, Mike. See ya. <laughs> see you in Oregon. <laughs> yeah. Bye bye.